Hey YouTube, Sama here. Welcome to today's tech tip where I'll be showing you a common mistake that first time PC builders make when assembling their own PC. Uh, this involves the RAM sticks and especially when you have only two of the four RAM slots uh, filled in. So as you can see, I have two slots uh, on the right uh, filled with two 8 gig sticks and the two on the left are empty this is not the optimal configuration as there is performance left on the table if you do this the optimal way to do this would be that if you're using one stick only you should use the slot that is furthest away from the cpu socket if you're using two sticks you you should first use the slot that is furthest away from the cpu socket and then leave one slot empty and then use the third slot so i'll move this stick into this channel over here so there's one gap between the two ram sticks uh, having that in this configuration will make sure that the ram is uh, running in dual channel mode instead of single channel as it is right now and that greatly impacts your performance in games so now I have moved the RAM sticks to the correct slots. So as you can see, there is one stick in this slot. Then there's an empty one. There's a stick in this slot and there's an empty one over here. And now the RAM is running in dual channel. You can see in this side by side comparison that the screen recording with the dual channel has the CSGO frame rates in the 200 to 300 range while the one in single channel has dips as low as 100 and it very infrequently uh, crosses 300 fps so if you are using two ram sticks and you have four slots on your motherboard make sure to run your ram in dual channel mode or you will be unnecessarily leaving performance on the table if this video was helpful, uh, please leave a like and subscribe so you don't miss on my daily tech tips. See you later. Bye.